Good morning, friends. Tell you what, it is a beautiful day. Beautiful day. Hey, Lillian over there. Got the boy here. Ain't been feeling too good this weekend. What I'm gonna do is uh, maybe clean the shop out. And uh, a friend of mine has got a bunch of dirt spreads, about six yards. He came and helped me spread the dirt for uh, for this. I had two yards there, and it looks like he's got a whole bunch of people coming. So maybe I won't have to do too much spread, and I'll just bring my shovels and lend moral support because I'll be in the way most of the time. Hopefully. <laughs> All right. I'm gonna go in here and clean my shop up. I got about an hour until I gotta be there. Just wanna give y'all an update. I love you. Y'all have a good one. Hardcore. What is up, my friends? I want to give a shout out to Mr. You Dizzy, the man. Everybody, go over to uh, You Dizzy's channel over and, and uh, tell old Dave good morning. Tell him hi. Give that man an internet hug. Got some weird shit going on in his neighborhood right now, and I know that'd be hard for me to deal with. I mean, so hard. You're a big man, Dave. You're a big man, you dizzy. All right. I uh, got some stuff going on. I've been sick all weekend. Felt bad. I done let it get Sunday on me, guys. <sighs> got a chili cook-off coming up. I can't, I can't do that. You see here, we had uh, this last year as a trophy display that we made for the chili cook-off. But something happened last year. Uh, let me show you. So I guess we, we should start last year. We should start uh, in the, like, uh, let's see, 2004 maybe, where I started cooking chili with the Guns N' Hoses Chili Cook-Off. I don't know, 2004, 2005, somewhere around there. But then in 2010, I won the best use of alternative meat. I used ostrich meat. I won the best use of candy. Two orange Tic Tacs. I still put to this day two orange Tic Tacs in every bite, uh, batch of chili I make. Best use of pumpkin. I fried it in bacon grease real thin. And man, it was crunchy. Put it on top of the chili. It was fire. Okay, and then see, that started the bug. Because, you know, well, the bug was all the, all the camaraderie and the badass people in the Guns N' Hoses Chili Cook-Off. But then I won this. Whew, okay, 11, 12... I didn't win anything but friendship of some great people and, and uh, the ability to go and do this. But then here comes 2013. At work, I worked at this print shop called Arkansas Graphics. We had a chili cook-off, and I won that sucker. And, and, I mean, I appreciate you, Kevin Wilcox, and the Arkansas Graphics family. You're some good people. I sure appreciate you. But then look at here. 2013. 8th Annual Guns and Hoses Chili Cook-Off. Best overall chili. Dun, dun. There you go. Then the next year, 2014, that's last year. Now you see, I had all of this on there. So I got to uh, build something over here to hold Mr. 2014 second place trophy. And we want it to be cobbled because this is a skid top. And if you remember, I said when I, when I did the application of my my foil over here that uh, you know I want everybody to tell it's a cobbled together pallet I want it to be that way dog chewed on it apparently right here we're gonna put some foil over that but uh, had the old lady weld up them and that was in a uh, on Instagram I think back uh, last year this time and uh, you know we made uh, the little stand out of it so what we're gonna do is we are going to cobble a shelf over here and make it uh, obvious like Lil Abner like Dog Patch USA obvious that it's cobbled on there and then we're going to put some foil on it and uh, make it match so we'll have a place to put all of our chili trophies and next year we'll just have to make another one since I'm going to get the first place again this year oh the life of a little doggy Jelly yeah there's what she looks like when she's loaded and uh, this, you know, is what we need. Alright, here's what I figure I'll do. I'll just uh, 
check one of these boards and cobble it on right here and make a shelf much like I did there and I have a spot for the other one for that trophy for this beauty right here all right let's get to it I don't know if I've told y'all this but uh, one of my favorite bands of all time is a little rock band or from Gravel Ridge Arkansas band called the uh, Monoxide Project uh, I'll play a little cut for you right here I remember the days that I was searching Chasing the light that kept me burning Thinking a hand would save me from my life so we can take it all in yeah there we go we got our little shelf cobbled on the side of it we got our uh, 
glittered up, I guess, fold up, and gilded. Yep. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, friends, I guess that's going to wrap this one up. I want to say one thing to uh, or in regards to uh, Mr. U Dizzy. I know a lot of people watch his channel. He's a, he's a wonderful man. He is one of the top, most awesome people I've met on YouTube. Uh, man, the man just out of the blue sent me a gas tank. But let me tell you, I know it's it's rough seeing the good part of town decline, Dave. And I I know it's hard, but don't put yourself in a position where uh, where you're going to go to jail trying to trying to take some other dumbass. Uh, heroin head or, or heroin dealer out for, for applying his trade on your corner I mean all you can do is get good video evidence uh, and it just you know do what you can I know you know some, some people in law enforcement there uh, and, and fire department and they, they know you're a good person just uh, man you, it's hard to see that stuff going on in your neighborhood but you, you can't put yourself in a position where, you, where it hurts you and your family and I know you know that. You're a good man, but uh, man, I sure wish your neighborhood would come together with you on that. That's got to be rough. Just want to say, I love you. Don't let this shit get you down. It's just, I know it's rough. Be happy, brother. Be happy. All right. I love you all. Like, share, subscribe, favorite. Go over and uh, give you Dizzy that hug we was talking about earlier. And uh, let the man know you all behind him. Because uh, he's sure behind a lot of other people. Alright. Y'all have a good one. Live dog.